All right, boys. Yes, sir. Welcome back to another video. As you guys have seen with the title and what you're seeing on screen, we are here with a 510 update preview and maintenance notice. And today we got some we got some content, boys. Dude, Netmarble actually slide and stuff. Obviously, it's a collab we're supposed to get anyways, but we have some cool stuff to talk about here today. Again, if you guys haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button, tick that notification bell, and leave a like. Let's see if we can crack a solid 300 likes for the waifus without any other delay. Let's jump straight into the video. So first up, the ultimate collaboration. Complete special missions to have RAM join your adventure guaranteed. Obviously, we all expected this, and we all knew this existed. We have new heroes, Amelia, Beatrice, Rem, and Ram. Here are the skill sets or just the icons because, you know, Global never actually wants to show you what they actually do until the game drops, which is, I mean, A, it's up to them. Uh, but right here, it does say get your diamonds back when you reach 600 loyalty points. So they still haven't specified if it's right away, like you immediately get it. Like they would have said right there immediately. So I'm hoping that is the case that it's immediately kind of it does actually structure out to the yeah it, it looks like immediately yeah so yeah it looks like it's immediately we have special collab check-in check-in up to uh check-in daily to get up to 10 collab pickup tickets which is again one that is a whopping one free multi we do have ReZero bingo now available let me tell you now you have to get that amelia costume my boy puck in a hoodie he's like he got dude he's got everything he looked too clean he got the drip and everything I'm telling you now, you, you gotta you gotta get that costume, bro. We have ReZero collab celebration events, and ooh, we got some good stuff over here. Can't wait to talk about it. We have a check-in event, special missions. We have the world quest. We have the pedal gears, deathmatch, and exchange shop. We have special a bingo event. We have king's upgrade material exchange event. We have the boosting events. We have the hero enhanced super and ultra success rate increase. Equipment salvage super slash ultra success rate increase. We have the main slash free stage stamina decrease. We also have the ReZero event title added. You can acquire that for the two week event period, which is always there. The event title is Re Britannia. We also have final boss Jericho and Gila. Finally, after how many decades have we been waiting with this update? We now have final boss Jericho and Gila. Let's go. Can't wait to see the next five weeks dead on. I'm just kidding. Um, we next have Tower of Trial Season 5, bro, what? Definitely, these aren't the same devs as you, I'm kidding, it's a, it's a joke, calm down. We have Tower of Trials Final Boss and a ReZero collab, all in one update. Content for decades, boys, be ready for it. Next up, we have rewards from the entire Final Boss, and as promised by Netmarble, it is, I think, the same as it always was, which, again, JP got, right? 55 diamonds altogether, which is not bad. Then we will get Final Boss Jericho, which is a whopping 43 more gems. So we in a pretty good situation right here. Again, it will last the entire month, so you have a time uh, limit to complete this. Make sure you guys jump into it right away, and you're able to get the Tower Conqueror title through this mode, which I think is usually how it is. We also have new costumes. The costume set of the 470S X ReZero collab heroes. Again, yo, Netmarble Loki has to make these costumes at some point for gems. Like, it's so stupid uh, that it's not. Like, at some point, Netmarble, come on. Like, I get it. You got to make money, but it, it would help out. Half of these costumes I wanted to buy regularly, and you can't unless you spend $25 per costume, which is very, very pricey. It is what it is, though. We have a collab diamond uh, event bundle one and bundle two. So if you are willing, they try and help you out as much as they can, I guess. $80 for this one, $40 for this one, $25, and say, I don't know how much this one is. So maybe $25 also. Next up, we have the Celebration Bundles, which I just talked about, so screw that. Also, Diamond Shop Bonuses, which I think are the tickets. With, with this, what is this? Knighthood uh, Competition Schedule, for anyone that cares about that. They've increased it now to 56 Knighthoods, so the top 56 can go and participate. Uh, they also adjust the rewards and all of that. We have System Changes, Lifesteal, Skill Balance, Adjustments, uh, Rank 1, all of this stuff. Yeah, take a look at this. There is a lot changing. Pause. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, I'll talk about that later. We have engravings. Right now we're here for the content. We'll, we'll, we'll focus on that later. Engravings for these four characters. Obviously, draw pool addition. We have uh, my boy Denzel now added to the part two ticket. So if you guys don't want him, go and spend all of your part twos now. We have draw events. This, again, festival draw, collab pickup draw, guaranteed. All this stuff is, in fact, ending. So if you guys want to go and, you know, get your stuff from it, go do it. If you want to go make your last rotation on certain things, go do it. Whatever it is, make sure you guys go and complete the entire login event for Denzel. Practically, uh, if you start today, even if you do, you'll only get two, uh, you know, tickets. So you won't even be able to complete that. 
But again, if anybody wants anything here, make sure you guys are taking care of this. There's a lot of stuff ending, and make sure you guys go through the entire game. All of this stuff is ending. Also, they didn't make an announcement for Hawk Pass, so... Tomorrow we will see what they put in the Hawk Pass. I'm actually wondering it. I think JP currently has the Zeldris costume in the Hawk Pass. So, I'm currently wondering what Nemaro throws in this Hawk Pass. Maybe it's something related to a collab. Maybe they actually throw the Stranger Things uh, outfits into the uh, entire uh, Hawk Pass. It could happen. It, it could not happen. We'll see how it goes. I mean, it would be pretty cool. And they won't do it, but it could be pretty cool. We'll see how it goes with that. Uh, but there you go. That looks like the entire update. Again, make sure you guys go and complete all this stuff because there is a lot and a lot leaving. I did upload a last chance video on the channel, so if you guys want to go check that out, it will help you out a ton. Also, the entire costume sale will be ending, so if anybody wants to go make their final purchases from the costume shop, whatever, secret shop, whatever, make sure you guys go and do that because there is a lot and a lot there. I know most of us are spending gems on waifu, so we won't be able to pick up any of this. Uh, if you want to buy any bundles, you want to whale out, go and get them before the end. But again, Summer of the Up Drop Pool Edition. We just have over here uh, a few changes on Lifesteal, which again, it's okay, I guess. Uh, inflicts the damage equal to 180% on attack on enemy, uh, and Lifesteal 20% to 40% of damage. So it's a quick buff over here. Based on Ultimate Move 1, increasing the Ultimate Move level does not increase the Lifesteal amount. So I mean, A, it's currently affected these heroes for anyone wondering. I'm guessing that Melascula will... I get <laughs> None of these really are used as much. Melascula being the only two units. Uh, so, yeah, there's that. Knighthood competition. Bundles being added. We have all of this with Tower of Trials. Again, pretty cool. Netmarble actually sliding us some content here. I'm actually hyped, right? We can go through 55 gems here. 43 gems here. I think the Tower Reserve event gives you about a free multi altogether. Plus, you have the 30 uh, or the free summons. So, I guess that is another 30 gems if you consider it that way. We also have two costume sets here. And then we have two costume sets with the exchange shop from the Pedal Gears boss. So, everyone's getting a free costume. It's going to be a very, very hyped event. Make sure you guys are ready for this. It is happening at what time? It is happening at 6 p.m. PDT. So, it'll be 9 p.m. EST for me uh, when it goes down. So, it'll be pretty late, I guess. It will last for a whopping four hours. That is a four-hour maintenance, which is not... Wait, is that is that usually longer than usual? I think it's like three hours usually. So... A little bit longer of a maintenance. It's going to be a, a, a fun time. I can't wait. Again, best of luck to everyone summoning. Hope you guys can pull everything you are looking for. It really is the ultimate collaboration. We have so much content to go through. We have four waifus jumping into the game. We have Subaru uh, left out of the game as well, which is, again, a meme at this rate. But, again, good luck, everyone. Best of luck on all of your summons. Hope you guys can pull everything you're looking for. I will be streaming this live over here on YT. Um, maybe exactly when the entire update finishes, I might go live then, or if I don't do it then, I'll do it the following day, right in the morning, early. Uh, so make sure you guys do join over that. It's going to be a complete vibe. Make sure to have notifications on so you guys are notified of my live stream. Thank you again for all the support on the channel. We've officially cracked 10.6k, and we're literally almost there to 10.7. So if you would like to support, again, hit that sub up. Make sure you guys left a like on this video. If you haven't already, uh, comment down below ReZero Hype, okay? Comment that down below so I know who watched till this point in the video. Peace out, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. One last time, best of luck on all your summons. Peace out. Later!